2021 update Philadelphia Sox Index, referred to as the chip sector. Now, Qualcomm did beat their earnings after the close, and I posted that one for our other guys. I sent the emails out with the links. So, the thing about it is, is this, is when we come down, we have support there at the 50-day moving average. We're up here at the moment now, okay? And we've had a lot of good earnings last week. Lamb Research happened to be one of them, and they posted a really good quarter. Outstanding. Stock is down 681 today, okay? So the thing about it is NVIDIA being another one. We have had a lot of leaders that AMD today, last night, posted that live uh, earnings report. Nice move. Option trading room was just specifically designed for you. And we're here to help. And we have the resources that you need. And we're willing to do that with you if you're willing to help yourself. We could start there. One of the warning signs is that we never did break highs in the socks. They lead rallies up, they lead rallies down. Been that way for the last 35 years I've been doing it. So that's always a warning sign. Especially we're going into May and they have not participated. And they've had, when you take a look at the reversal day today, is, is that the sell signal is minus 10. And we've had the sell signal started here. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight days. Okay. We had an attempted three day rally without taking out previous highs. That is a warning sign. It always is. Until we do take out those highs and the semiconductors outperform. They always outperform the broader market, and they do. So nonetheless, it's just something to be very aware of and that we tested the 50-day moving average over here on this day, and that day was on 420. And the high was 3171, and the low was 3106 on that day. Then we consolidated here, and then we had the little breakout and then we had a failure that went along with it. And, you know, I can just say that it's always a very important part of the market. So once we clear out of these earnings and, and things start happening, just remember what moves the world. It's the chip sector. And it's always been that way. They reported some really outstanding results and they've had a lot of good things to say in that sector as they always do because they're always the leader once again support would be back at that 50-day moving average and without the participation of the breakout in the philadelphia Sox index and the market could have a pullback in the month of may and it will have a pullback in the month of may but we do look for various different warning signs to go ahead and give us that guidance. And that guidance is waiting on you. Sign up for the free five-day trial. Let us power you.